Good day, sir. Sorry, what's your take on the president's absenteeism? First and foremost, ex Abontasha and Nim Kodi Oslokweto, as I vociferously yak the yak, converse, articulate ex Morimo to your articulation. I'm not trying to obfuscate or obliterate, equivocate or engulf and envelop my spectators in a cloud of cataclysmic somnolence and discombobulated hamatan. <coughs> I'm trying to be meticulous, fastidious, scrupulous as I'm sent apparatus to articulate. It is enormously calamitous that the president have asquatulated the masses as I presently foretold dictum merat tete a tete with the media. Wool up, nigga, wool up, wool up, wool up, just wool up. It is highly sardonic and lugubrious. Some calumnious and scurrilous entities perfunctorily believe that the president has gregariously malingered. Stop blaming the president for traveling. I'm a teetotaler of politics. This is a non sequitur. And I'm trying to be Tinguma Jig or Tinguma Bob in this tatai. You just they invite hit rashes. I am vexed at the economic fiasco, which is the aftermath of the modus vivendi and operandi of the skullduggery, bondogol, acrimonious politicians who are not dictum factum or memento mori, but proceed and galvanize to deglutionize the pantagrelan and prop the Gnagian amount of money. Tremendously and stupendously organizing the economy, having a catanum vulgus, sine qua non, a bosun's non tolly to soon can be referred to a white elephant with no aminos rivatendi, leaving the country in rockers, cantacross, poporigmos, elephantine, colossal, problem, gagatuan, gaga. Thank you.